Hey everyone, Force Free Star here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install Google Chrome on your MacBook. Now, we're going to be doing this on Big Sur, but similar stuff can be processed on even the later version of Mac OS. So, let's get started. So, first thing you need to do is go into your Safari browser, which will be right here, or you can search it up here if you can't see it. We'll need to get to basically the internet, so make sure you're connected to Wi Fi. Now, once you're connected, you're going to want to just simply search for Google Chrome. And once you search for Google Chrome, that's going to go ahead and take you to this site to download Chrome or basically the first link. And then click on download and it'll say, do you want to allow? We'll allow. And then right here, we're going to see that it's being downloaded up right here as well. You can see it's being downloaded. Now it does, it's a 215 meg here right now. So we're going to wait for that uh, .gmg file to go ahead and download and then we'll install it. So almost there. So if you have a faster internet, of course it's gonna be quicker, slower internet, it's gonna take a little bit longer. Now once you have that, you should see it up here or here you wanna double click on it. And once you double click on it, it will begin opening up that file.gmg Google Chrome. It'll verify it and then also install it for us. So we're opening it up right now. Cool. And then you're going to want to do is take that and drag it into the applications folder to install it. And then on the application folder, you should see it's going to copy over the Google Chrome to applications so it can install that application on our MacBook here. And once we see that it's still going here, we're going to wait till it's fully complete. And from there on, you pretty much have done it. And if you want, I can you can simply press and hold and drag this down. I usually like to put it down here next to Chrome Safari. So I have two browsers. So I'll put it, drag it right here. And then let's go ahead and close out all of this other stuff. So if I don't want to use Safari any longer, close it out. And then I can simply double click on it like that and it should go ahead and load up Safari the first time it takes a moment but let's see if it goes ahead and opens it up so we're doing a verification when you see this you want to allow and open that because the first time we download it and you can set it as a default browser if you like or you can make something else I know on you I'll just make it as default as I like you to use it now same thing it will allow use Chrome and you don't have to but if you like to and then we have Chrome here you can sign into your account or start using it so that's how you download and install Google Chrome on your MacBook I hope this video was helpful so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your MacBook and other devices. We'll see you guys next time.